Hi, this is Dr. Machado. Recently, you have been scheduled to uh, undergo excision of a volar flexor retinaculum ganglion cyst. Big name, meaning removal of a little lump on your finger. And in this video, I want to give you some extra information for your upcoming surgery. Because your surgery will be done here in our office, there is no need for you to see your primary care physician for history and physical examination. And the most important portion is that you're going to love it, is that you do not need to be fasting. You can have breakfast, coffee, and even lunch before you come to see us. When you arrive to our facility, after you've been checked in, I'm going to take you to the exam room. And that is the time that I'm going to numb and anesthetize your finger. Some patients don't like needle at all, but uh, I have a special technique to inject and you'll see it's not going to be that bad. After you've been injected, we like to wait a few minutes before you take you back to the OR, about 15 to 20 minutes. Once you're in the OR, because you're awake, you can choose the music we're going to listen in the OR so we can enjoy it with you. We're going to make the incision, remove the cyst, and send to pathology. Once the surgery has been completed, you're going to have a sterile dress into your hand that you're going to be able to start moving your fingers immediately. When you're in the recovery room, my staff will talk to you and will give you special information for you to start moving your hand right after surgery. And because I anesthetize your finger, you're going to have pain relief up to 8 hours after surgery. And for this reason, the majority of the patients only require Tylenol and Ibuprofen for pain. As soon as you get home, it's important for you to keep your hand elevated and apply ice to your incision. And when you're 2 days after surgery, you can remove all the dressings, take everything out, the incisions will be open, you can put a band-aid if you want it, and you can get the incision wet. I will see you back in between 10 to 14 days after surgery. And at that time when we return, we're gonna check the incision, make sure they're healing well, the sutures will be removed. I'm gonna discuss the pathology with you. We're gonna talk a little bit about scar massage and also what you can do and cannot do with your hand. So I hope this video could give you some more information to make you more comfortable and relaxed for your surgery. And especially I wanna say thank you because you chose me as your surgeon and this means a lot to me. So I'm looking forward to seeing you soon uh, for your upcoming surgery. Thank you very much.